my name is Carrie, and I'm a Monate Independent Market Partner, and I believe I just sent you some samples. So if you receive samples from me or any other market partner, um, here's some quick instructions on how to use them and what you're going to do. So if you received, let's say, the Rejuvenic sample, as well as most people get at least two of these um, things, so whether it's a shampoo, conditioner, replenish mask, whatever it is, okay? They all look about the same, just they have a different word on the front of them, but they all stay monate on them. They also have the instructions on the back. And I'm gonna give you a couple of ex extra different instructions so that you're gonna use these to a uh, proper advantage, okay? So first thing off, this is the oil. So this oil is a really small package, okay? But there's quite a bit of oil in here, so just be careful with this. So there, I'll get it so it's not doing this. So there's some information about the oil in here, which you are welcome to read. Please do so, there's nothing wrong with it. There's 101 uses to this thing, but we only usually give you one reason, thing to do with it, okay? When you're opening this, don't rip it across, okay? And I will tell you why, because oil spills, right? It's a liquid. So what I suggest telling people, I always tell people is either do a cut just across here like this, or take a pin and poke a kind of decent, not a tiny size pinhole, but poke a little hole in there, okay? And then that way you're only gonna get a small amount out. Um, you can take this right off and then just put it on your countertop until you wanna use it next, okay? Now, the shampoo, conditioner, mask, that's all we have right now for samples. Um, when you get this package, what you're gonna do, you can see right here, okay? This is the replenish mask, by the way, just so everyone knows. There's a little thing here. You can actually just rip that open, okay? So when you're in the shower, get in the shower, um, open this up beforehand if you really want to, or when you're in the shower, wet your hair really, really, really well. Then take this, the shampoo first, not this one, the shampoo. Put a small amount in your hands, massage it in your hands, then put it on your scalp. So just massage it into your scalp. It may or may not lather. That is okay. Okay, so just leave it in for about a minute to two. Rinse it out. Now you're going to wash a second time. Again, these samples is 10 milliliters or 0.34 fluid ounces. Okay, I usually see at least two to three maybe sometimes four washes out of a little sample like this. So less is more. Well, like I said, uh, rinse, then repeat. So when you're repeating, just add, just, we usually say, I usually say, just a tiny little bit more. So the first time was a dime, the second time is a nickel size, okay? Um, again, put it in your hands, put it in your scalp. Now, you will get a little bit of lather. Not a ton, it's not gonna be like huge all the way up here, but just a little bit of lather. So do that, leave it on for another minute or two, rinse, repeat. Sorry about that, if you saw my child coming through, that's okay. I'm a mompreneur, so I have to work with my child is around the house sometimes, and that's just the way it goes. Um, now, depending on which conditioner you received. Now, if you received a conditioner that is the leaving conditioner, which is called Restore, you're going to get out of the shower, uh, dry your hair off a little bit, then put a little bit of the restore, the leave-in conditioner, ears, I'm massaging your hands, ears down. I usually do a ponytail, okay? And I do this actually for the rinse out conditioner too. And then, um, then style is needed, okay? If you have a rinse out conditioner, like the Revitalize, um, or the IR conditioner, any of those, again, a little bit in your hands, ponytail, ponytail down, okay? And then you can work your way up, okay? Your scalp does not need a lot of conditioner. And why? Because if you have too much conditioner left on your scalp, it's actually gonna overwork. Um, and sometimes that's what causes some of the oiliness and sometimes that's what causes dryness too. So there's no rhyme or reason exactly, but your scalp does not need a lot of conditioner left on it, okay? Now, if you have a rinse out conditioner, please make sure you're rinsing it out. With these products, you want to use warm water and rinse out really well, okay? Um, if you have the replenish mask, there are some separate instructions on here. So you're going to use, put a little bit in your hair, uh, ears down before you condition, 
okay? So if you're using the replenish mask, you use this between the shampoo and your conditioner. So you put the replenish mask on, leave for about 10 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes or 20. Um, I don't know, go do something. Go clean your house for a little bit, I don't know. And then rinse it out, then use your conditioner, okay? Conditioner is a must after your replenish mask. That's all I can say about that, okay? Um, and then style is needed. So like I said, some of these things were gonna last a while. They're gonna last a few washes. Always wash twice every time you're in the shower. Um, you should be doing it with most of your shampoos anyway today. Um, most of them do say rinse and repeat. The oil, use this as a pre-treatment. If you want the 101 uses, ask your market partner, um, your sponsor, anyone. They, we all have the information that we can give to you for what the 101 uses are. I hope you have a wonderful day and that this was very helpful. If you don't have a market partner, please contact me on the link below and I can definitely find get you some samples as well as um, some information if you're looking for it. Have a wonderful day. Bye now.